Gallo with Headedness. Geordie, what was this that you got in Prague? I mean, you're saying the last stock of what? Daddy long legs. The thing is, that's why I stopped tying so many flies. There's a new fly shop on the Czech Republic. No. But what was this? What was this braided leader you were talking about? Uh, they're still knocking them out. They were sort of big in the '80s. No. But it's just the turnover is. Really I can believe it. Bruce and Walker will still do those, but they're a heavier beast. Yeah. I put a weight forward six for a yeah. It's a bit heavy yeah. with, with, with any length, but it loves a full weight. We, we need, yeah, because yeah. you, you've got a bit of a wind if you want. Anyway, well, that, that's going to be have to take to compare a, that with the safe. Looking at this now, what would you say? So what is this, Rob? This is a hardy marvel. Three piece, seven and a half foot, rated four weight, loves a three weight. What kind of a reel have you got on there, Geordie? Um, my favourite's from the 90s, CFO Orvis, but hardy made. Oh yeah. But, uh, a look at that. there we go, this little thing, but it's, um, it's a disc brake and you can take the ratchet out. So no, oh, come on. Oh, well, well, no, no, what's happening in the fly box? Well, what's happening in the fly box? I've tied these, oh, and wow. they always were, everyone says it's a gold rib hairs here, and, then, and I have heard lambourne grayling are notoriously difficult to catch. And I was in a sewing shop, and I saw some holographic ruby tinsel, so I have tied what I should call a ruby ribbed hair's ear. Nah. And it's it's just got that bit of red in it. I'll tell you what that's nice about that is it's got the little hairs coming out of it like it's uh, it, 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 it's, uh yeah. the shuck, you know. Exactly. The that yeah. is partridge tail. Nice. Let's just have a look at the uh, the whipping on that. Can well we? this is this is why I picked this up for about sixty percent of the market rate because it's been re-whipped. Really good workmanship but it's nylon and it's polyurethane varnish, so it's a little milky. But I have sourced the original silks, the tangerine orange and the dark <laughs> Well, they, they kind of did these and, uh, in have it, this. like a lime green tipped with tangerine, but that's a bit gaudy. <laughs> what, you think the orange silk will be better? <laughs> Let's check out what Mim's got here. And it's a seven piece, six weight, hardy with a Golden Prince Reel. And of course, with one of these vests on, all my pockets are full, <laughs> I am ready to go and catch any kind of fish yeah. in any kind of weather.
to see you too. It is just great. Cheers, Peter. Thank you very much. And this, I have to say, Roxburgh, whatever it's called, is definitely hardly <laughs> Swedish. How was your morning, Jordi? I learned a lot. It's certainly quite tricky. Red, sussed it.